All right, welcome back. We are gonna fight Orpheus again. And we're not gonna lose this time, I swear to God. Folks! Skip! Alright, we're gonna slow the battle down so that I can actually see what the fuck's happening. Do you have any idea? Speed it up. No, still standing. In your heart. Very well. Okay. Um. So we'll use a cura on. No, allies. Jesus. On. Let me help you. What? No, I had. Oh, god damn it! That's not what I wanted. Default. Default. Here I go. And default. Get on a breeze myself. Ugh. All right. Um, we're gonna brave, and we're gonna cure everyone. Uh, well, actually, I guess we don't really need to. Okay, we won't brave then. Let's do a white magic cure on uh, Elvis. He heals. Oh, thanks for bailing me out. Default. Right, Ooh, I'm poisoned. Okay. Default. Um. Default. Not bad. Let me at him. All right, we're gonna we're gonna just charge up our our uh, our BP. Here. Let me see. Um, okay, now let's brave because I want to do a bassoona and then a cura on everyone. Does that feel better? Let me help you. Sorry to be a pain. All right. Um, <clears throat> and then we're gonna brave. Uh, default. Sorry. All right. So we got a lot of stuff that we can do now. We're going to. I guess I don't really need to. No, I'm not going to do that. Then. Let's do some heroics. Let's do some. Hmm. Oh my god, that takes a lot of HP. Uh, weaken their magical attack and weaken their physical attack. Uh, uh, I want to skull bash Orpheus. Uh, and then just examine him. Just to see how much health he's got left. Come on! Get some! So, Toxolotl's a weak to water, and Orpheus is also weak to water. So, we're going to brave three times. Let's use a potion on uh, Gloria, and then let's do some good stuff. Uh, martial arts. Okay, I don't need any of that, so I'm just gonna... 
attack. Um, Let's see. Thank you. Ow. You rang? That sucked. You better be ready for this. All right. And now we're just gonna blast everything with Bazaar. Heat sorcery. Away and fire your heat. Heat sorcery. Away and fire your heat. Okay. So he's defaulted. Better cover up. Default. Oh, God. oh. You're going to regret hurting my friends. Ow. Um. Okay, we're gonna items. Phoenix down. My time has not yet come. Uh. Cura, and then maybe a protect. Seems like you did. <laughs> Back in the game. Oh, thanks for feeling you. Oh, well, what's next? I wonder. Oh, you just put me to sleep. Shit. Uh, default. Come and get it. Oh, he's defaulting so much. All right, let's okay. brave. Item. We're going to wake up Bell Gloria and then hit him with uh, a shield this time. Here it comes. Um. <clears throat> I'll sit this one out. Oh, no big deal. Right. Let's see. Right. Sixty-four. Oh. Uh, let's grave up, and we're going to do Let me at him. Um, all right, we need to use a potion on a bell. Hopefully she won't go down. Okay. Whew. Uh, we're default. <clears throat> Come and get it. God damn it. Stop. Okay. Two arms. Um. Okay. Way to Cura. Everyone. Sorry to be a pain. God. <laughs> um. Okay, we're gonna use a wake up. Aye, this should do it. Let me at him. Default. Default. Oh. Okay. He's not defaulted. So we're gonna hit him with Blizzaras. Sorcery. Oh, fuck off! God! Uh. Oh, okay. Alright, this is gonna be annoying, but we're gonna do it. Uh, I 
honestly don't know if she has enough MP. Protect on Gloria. Since she's gonna be more exposed. A little magical assistance. Let me Adam. Okay. <clears throat> Let's do uh Alright, it looks like he did physical attacks, so let's do defang. But it's nothing compared to the pain that burns inside my soul. I bitch. I hate him. Into my work. That's how masterpieces are born. Time for you to bow out, princess. There's only one starring role in this production. I'm not hot. Okay. Uh, default. Um. And default. Oh, not enough HP, shit. Down goes Adele. Uh, uh, Phoenix down. Get Adele back up, and then we'll hit him with a Bizarre. Potion Gloria twice. This will do it. You have my thanks. Here, try this. A welcome intervention. Huh. You're all right. Oh! Uh. Let's get up. See. I am in your debt. Default. Uh, cure. Hey, let's give you a five star. You have my thanks. Huh. Okay. I'll sit this one out. Default. Cure. Adele. Oh god. Oh my god. Fucking hell. Fuck, do I not have any mini ethers? Oh no. Um. Yeah, I can't use Cura. Shit. Um, and then hope that we don't get <laughs> Be healed. Cheers. I owe you one. 
A little one. gift. A little gift. Huh. It's nothing. Come and get it. Okay. Uh. Uh. Oh my god, fuck off! Oh, we got him! <laughs> that was... Oh... <laughs> the voice line! Uh, fuck you! That was horrible. Okay. Oh. All right. Good. Thank God that's over. Seriously denied my revenge after all I've done. Oh, I hate my life. Oh, spare us. Now, where is the crystal? You think I'm just going to tell you? Yes, unless you'd prefer me to crush your throat so that you'd never be able to moan about how hard your life is again. Or sing Oh my god, Adele. No, no, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. Bernard has it. Something went wrong when he tried to use it and he flooded the city. So it was him after all. The fool. Wow. Where is it now? The guy who looks I, really I bad. I, I don't know where he hid it. He only told me that he had it, I promise. So, after all your big talk, you basically don't know anything. It doesn't oh surprise me. I wouldn't tell this weasel my secrets either. Still, we know Bernard has it now at least. And, with another asterisk to boot. Ha <laughs> And what do we have here? Oh. Do we have more information about the book? What's it going to tell us? The crowd's getting ugly, Lord Bernard. They're asking for you to put in a special guest appearance. Hmm. I'm very annoying of them. Deal with it, will you? I don't care how, just get it done. Your wish is my command. Oh. Okay. Well, that's something that we already knew. What was that? But why did the asterisk How tell us you? that? But no one could have... Whatever. Looks like it's now or never. <coughs> what the... <laughs> Caught you napping? You should know by now I'm always ready to make a dramatic exit. Orpheus! Later, losers! Catch you on the flip side! Oh my god. Forget him for now. My men will apprehend him soon enough. I... I owe you all an apology. Huh? My behavior towards you back at the palace was... unforgivable. Having seen Where did you this fight, come from? I realize now oh, how blind okay. I have been. Hey, no need to go overboard. We didn't take it personally. You are more I kind did. to me than I deserve. Hey, Elvis. What was that we saw before? When your book glowed up like that? Well, I told you it reacts to asterisks, didn't I? The ones we got our hands on in Halcyonia helped me read a little more of the writing inside it. But this time, we seem to have been shown something from the past of the asterisk's previous owner instead. I, I, I've no idea why though, so don't go asking me to conjure up visions at will. And I guess that means we're no wiser than we were before, right? But no less yep. wise either. Exactly. Right? And that's the whole point of traveling the world in search of knowledge. To keep putting the pieces together until it all finally makes sense. I suppose you're right. What? A bird. A bird? Is something the matter? Was it a spy no. or Saruman? It's nothing. Um, let's see. 
there a chest in here? No! You're telling me the last chest isn't in here? Where the fuck haven't I been? Oh god. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm not fucking around with that. I got my ass handed to me in that fight. I just want to get out of here. I got no MP left. Oh, is that the chest? That is the chest. How do I get that? Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, this this right here. Ah, oh, okay, just some pig. That's cool. We out of it. All right, let's go back to the thing and do the thing. Ah. <sighs> Bernard. How many Good thing times? That office is Not fucked up. while I'm eating. The smell of you is enough to turn a man's stomach. Oh, awful feral creature. But. I have just taken delivery of a simply divine vintage. Do not disturb me. Unless, that is, you wish to return to the squalor from which you came. Sorry. Fine clothes, so fine mean. music, and fine food and drink. What else does a man live for? How else can one revel in the glory of existence? I... I'm sorry. Please don't send me away. No. Oh. Stop fretting, you foolish child. Shut up and do as I say, and all will be just as it should be. Okay. Aww. There's a good girl. Anyhow. Anyway, I've finished now. Make your report. No, you haven't! Orpheus <laughs> attacked the princess as you ordered. You haven't eaten! But he was beaten, and now he's run away. <laughs> Pathetic. I had thought his history with the royal nuisance would be sufficient to spur him on. But it seems not. Very well, you may leave. Oh, poor anyhow. And what to do now, I wonder? I suppose the first order of business will be a little chat with a certain interested party. Oh no. Is it Adam again? That bastard. With his stupid hair and his stupid mustache. All right, all right, let's just get the fuck out of here. Oh. What? I have no idea where I'm going. There we go. Um. There we go. Ah. Uh. That's cool. I honestly can't remember why Orpheus was in the ruins in the first place. Prince Castor, I have been looking for you everywhere. And now you have found me. Princess Gloria, I must insist that you refrain from taking the prince out of the city without notifying the relevant authorities. I was not taken anywhere, Dromed. I went of my own free will. Your Highness, whilst I understand your desire to aid our nation's allies, might I remind you that Musa is no more. There is precious little benefit to be gained from spending your valuable time on lost causes. What the Whoa. fuck? Aren't this guy's a bitch! Supposed to be polite? I am simply stating the truth. Musa may be no more, Dromed, but our duty to Princess Gloria is very much alive and well. Her Highness and her friends will remain until such time as they have ascertained the truth of the situation regarding the crystal. And during that time, they will continue to be our honored guests. But, 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 uh, as you wish, your highness. But please, I must beg you to conclude your dealings here quickly, Princess Gloria, for Savanon's sake. When your business here is done, Prince Custer, you are needed at the palace. What a bitch! I hate I him! I'm feeling too welcome right now. 
Well, yeah, right. You can hardly blame them for not wanting the prince bogged down with our business. Uh, the king is missing after all. Dromid means well, I assure you. What if he's been eaten? Oh, please, it's entirely understandable. By. I'm sure I would feel exactly the same in this position. You are too kind. Maybe that's why he lines. didn't touch his mate. You know, I get the feeling that our distracting <laughs> the prince isn't all that Dromid's worried about. It seems to me that he has another reason for wanting us out of the way. I cannot begin to imagine what else might be on his mind, but I will ask him if it makes you feel better. For now, I must return to the palace. I will rejoin you when my business there is concluded. Bye. Being a prince must be hard work. Not that we have it easy, I guess. Aye. Someone tells me Bernard's not going to be telling us where he's hidden this crystal without some arm twisting. Perhaps That's his companion true. can help us. Have to fight him. The girl. Yeah. Oh, yes. What was her name again? Annie Hal? Yes, that was it. Let's see if we can track her down. Yes! It's time to go find the cute girl. Uh... Let's just have a look and see if we have any more side quests. We do. We got two over here. Um. Hello. Oh, we got a cutscene with it too. Everything okay, though? I'm fine. I just wish I could say the same about my shoes. Yeah, looks like they've seen better days. <laughs> you should get some new ones. I know. But these are... well... What's up with you two, eh? What are you both staring at? Crikey! The stare of your shoes, Adele! They look like a hungry goblin's had a munch on them! Hey! <laughs> don't say that! These are the shoes you... Wait... Oh. I passed a wee footwear emporium not long back. You can get a new pair from there. Oh, it's a classy place, though. I'll tell you what, I'll go on oh. and the way. They're the hey, shoes that wait. he bought her! Elvis! Elvis! Oh, why do you never listen? Uh... Guys? Help find some new shoes for Adele. Did I do this quest already? Deliver the flask to the ruins. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> uh, where's this? Where's this side quest? Over there. Right, I'll just run over there. Let's. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, look. Just feed him well, and he'll be fine. Look at it, pup. Thank you so much for helping him. What are you doing? Get away from my daughter. I told you not to go near her. Away with you. Go on, get out of here. Hey, That's there's so no mean. need to talk to her like that. Hmm? And who are you exactly? It doesn't matter who I am. She helped your dog. The least you can do is thank her. I did not ask for her help. And I am not in the habit of thanking vagrants. Come, we are leaving. Uh, right. What a fucking... Why is everyone in this game okay. a fucking asshole? I'm fine. <laughs> You're the one from... Before. Yep. Good to see you again. You want to tell me what just happened? I was born into a traveling circus. I've only been in the city since Bernard took me in. They don't like me here. They call me Vagrant. Outsider. Well... It can take time to settle in somewhere new. It's the same for everyone. I know. No, it's not. At least they let me live here. Thanks for sticking up for me. Bye. Wait. No, Erha. We. You're a best friend now. That's why we're here in Savalon. We were wondering if we might ask you a question or two. Okay. Can we do it at my house? I have to feed everyone. Huh? Feed everyone? This oh, is my house. She's... Oh! Whoa! Ah! Oh god! Did you keep monsters? This is the everyone you were talking about? 
Yes. It's their dinner time. Come on, little ones. Din-dins. What? Here, Bernie. Ah, oh, you must be hungry. <laughs> okay. I thought it was going to be a fight <laughs> too. What is it? But... Uh, nothing. Better not tell her I was worried we were the Dindins. <laughs> so, you live with a bunch of animals and monsters, huh? I've had them all since I was in the circus. Our caravans were attacked by bandits when we came near the city. Oh, My friends look at that here protected freaky me. Freaky snake. Look at his That's fucking how I ears. To survive. I was the only one. I oh. I'm so sorry to hear that. It's not so bad. Now I have Bernard. He lets me work at the gaming hall. And he lets me live here with my friends. The money he gives me helps me look after them all. I don't know what I'd do if he ever sent me away. And why would he do that? I don't know. That's just what he says. If I ever let him down, he'll get rid of me. That's horrible. Oh. You're not some thing he can just cast aside? He's allowed. He's the one who saved me. Wow. You said you were looking for something. Yes. It's a blue jewel, about this big. The crystal. You know what it is? Uh... Yes. You do? Really? Please, tell us everything you know. Any information you can give us is sure to prove useful. Oh, God. Hi. Are we going to have sorry. to fight her? I can't help you. If I do, Bernard will send me away. But you have to. You... Sorry. You need to leave. Oh, anyhow. She's not gonna tell us anything, huh? No, and I don't want to push her too far either. She's been through enough. I suppose we'll just have to look elsewhere, then, eh? What about the people we saw talking to Orpheus in front of the gaming hall? They seem to be rather angry with Bernard. Perhaps one of them might know something useful. Okay. Um. So we've got our side quests. Uh, hello? Thank you. I would like to talk to people. Thank you very much. Haven't bought a pair yet, huh? Well, I'm trying, but... How many times must I tell you? We are closed. See? Big man here is no being very cooperative. Don't tell me. You said something stupid and now he won't serve you. What are you on about? I haven't done anything. Look, pal, be reasonable, eh? You can sell us one wee pair of shoes, surely. No, I cannot. I must go and look for my beloved Diana. The poor little thing. What's the matter, what? sir? Has this Diana gone missing? Yes, the evening meal dissatisfied her, and she ran out of the house. I have not seen her since. I cannot help but fear she will spend yet another night gallivanting hither and thither. Wow, that doesn't sound good. How old is she? She is three. Three? Oh, no wonder you're worried. Okay, you stay right here I bet it's and a we'll dog. go find her. Can you tell us a little about what she looks like or what she's wearing, maybe? She has a red collar. A red collar, right. Anything else we... Wait. White fur. Oh. <laughs> it's and a the dog. most beautiful bright blue eyes. She really is oh, the it's most a cat. wonderful cat in the kingdom. Huh? Uh, hang on. Cat? She's your flipping pet kitty. But she is so much more than a pet to me. She is my dearest friend. She is my life. Aww. If anything were to happen to her, I... Well, I... The grief would be too much. I cannot think let alone I suppose that's I true. That she is if something happened to Maud, I'd Whoa, be pretty bloody there. upset too. It'll be okay. Aye, come on. There's no need to panic. Like my friend here said, we'll find your moggy walkie for you. You will? Of course we will. We'll have her back with you in no time, don't you worry. And then, once that's done, you can give us a pair of shoes to say thanks. The ladies here are falling to pieces, as you can see. You're unbelievable. If you bring my darling Diana back to me, you may have any pair in the shop. It would be my pleasure. All right. Guess we'd better start looking then. Oh, God. Do we actually have to look for this fucking cat? <sighs> All right. 
Let's have a look at the map. Let's see if it's in the city. Okay, it's like over there. Cat! Come here! I'm catching you! Hey, oh my look, god! That it's a nightmare! The shopkeeper was talking about, no? Alrighty then! Leave the rest to me! Yeah, kitty kitty! Ch -ch 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 -ch. Come on, Diana! Come to Elvis! <laughs> huh? It's actually working! Oh, kitty! That's right! Ch -ch -ch -ch. Come to Elvis. Ooh, good kitty. And I. Oh, <laughs> she's coming to say hello to Auntie Adele. Hey there, little puskin. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so so. <laughs> yes, there's a good puss. No. Oh. Well, looks like we found our stray cat. Let's get her back home. Come on, kitty kitty. Okay. <laughs> that was dumb. Oops. Talk to this boy. Oh, my dear Diana. You are alive and you have returned to me. My life is worth living <laughs> once more. <laughs> I love how they just cut that short. That was like a shit post. Any pair of shoes you like. Should I also repair those you are already wearing? What do you reckon, Adele? Hmm. Yeah. I can't part with these just yet. Let's get them fixed up. Fair enough. Heaven knows why you'd want to keep the ratty old things, though. What was that? Uh, nothing. Um, oh! Ah! Oh, there goes my blessed back. I must be all this traipsing around the place. <laughs> I'd better head back to the inn for a wee lie down. Ta-ta! Speaking of going to the hey, inn for Adele, a lie down... I mind if I ask you why you're so attached to those old shoes? You really want to know? Well, all right then. Adele, tell me the story. Give me the fucking goss. Spill the fucking tea! I want to know them deets. This loading screen is killing my joke. Come on. There we go. Oh. Gah, damn these things. They're too dang tight. Gah, that's it. I'm better off barefoot. Go on. Good riddance. Ah, what the? <laughs> What's this? Shoes? Who's throwing shoes about the place? I... I'm sorry, I, I didn't see you there. What's it was you there? What's the big idea? Oh, I, um... Just kind of, uh... uh... Look, I don't know what's going on, but it's no reason to go chucking stuff around willy-nilly, all right? I'm sorry, okay? You can have them if you like. As an apology, I mean. Ah, nah, you're all right. They wouldn't fit me anyway. <laughs> never come to mention it. They look a wee bit small for you and all. Know a lot about women's feet, do you? Got oh, some God. Kind of special interest? Is this. Oh, God! What are you on about? I'm just what the fuck? Exceptional Did she just accuse him of up. having a foot fetish? You giving your shoes yes. away anyway. You can't go around in bare feet. Oh, don't even try to talk me into putting those things back on. Not happening. Fair enough. Wait there a second. Here, new shoes. Go on, try them on. For me? But why? Just try them on, will you? They'll fit a lot better than the others, I promise. Well, okay. Wow, they're perfect. No way. Oh, this makes such a difference. Glad to hear it. You Aww, very well go traveling cute. round in shoes you can barely walk in. Are you really giving me these? Hey, you can buy me a drink to say thanks if it makes you feel better. If you're looking for a drinking buddy, you're looking in the wrong place. But I suppose these are at least a one-drink pair. Ha <laughs> ha! That's the spirit. 
Come on, I'm good company, I promise. Aw, oh, that's cute. That's actually a bit of storytelling <laughs> that I like. Hit in the head by flying shoes more often. This wee drinkies put me in a grand old mood ahead of my journey. You're going away somewhere? You could say that, aye. I'm off to hunt down <laughs> some wee thingbies they call asterisks. Asterisks? Okay. Hey, how about you hire me to come with you? Uh, hire you? What do you mean? Well, I may not look like it, but I'm actually a mercenary. And it can be dangerous out there. You need someone to watch your back. Tell you what, why don't I give you a discount? After all, they really are great shoes. Oh. And it's it's very kind of typical that Elvis wouldn't remember why they're the so truth significant. Is, I didn't much enjoy looking for Edna all by myself. She'd left the village without telling anyone where she was going, without leaving any clues. Oh right, because she's just looking for her sister. around from place to place, but then I met Elvis, and for the first time I had a direction. In a way, an erection. That's when my journey really started. <laughs> wow. <laughs> no wonder you can't leave them behind. Okay, okay. They're a reminder of how it all began, huh? Yes, but please don't tell Elvis. Oh. He'd never let me hear the end of it. Don't worry. I can't actually see what dot that Your was. Your secret's safe it's with fine. me. I'll look you don't it. think it's weird, do you? <clears throat> Keeping hold of a pair of stinky old shoes? Nope. Not at all. If you ask me, they deserve to come along for the ride. <laughs> they do, huh? Thanks. They do. Okay, so I'm gonna change... Now that I've got... Um... Oh yeah, I need to find the shop too. Where's that? Uh... Uh, the shop is down at the front, I think, because I am out of shit. Um, let's have a rest here. Um, because we got beat up. We got beat up real bad. Um, we'll have a look at that. Well, I'll have a look at that party chat off camera but let's go back um, there's the shop um, we need some mini ethers let's buy 10 um, we're also running low on potions and we'll just get another two phoenix downs We've got plenty of tents. It's at metal. Okay. Alright. Cool. Let's head back to the uh, ruins so that we can find the guy, give him his flask, and then. Hopefully, not have to go back again. Can I just sprint, please? Thank you. Um. Okay. So, I can't quite remember where this guy is. I think he's close to the start. So let's have a look. And pretty much everyone, like everything, just runs away from me, so... Should be easy enough to find him again. I don't like this... This blur around the edges. It very much reminds me of, uh... uh whatever it is. The, uh... Link's Awakening. Oh, God! Examine 
sandworm, and let's just build it up. They're weak to wind and light, I think. But that sandworm's gonna be annoying. Was a there piece of cake. <laughs> um, no, he was down on the ground, ground floor. Maybe this way. No, this way. There he is. Um... Oh, for fuck's sake! We have to do it again?! Oh. This sucks. Yeah, at least I know where I'm going now. Fuck you! Fuck this fucking side quest. It's not even going to be worth it, I swear to god. your fucking hands. Don't ask me to bring a fork back. Fucking cunt. Alright. Let's go get his stupid fucking fork. Give me a fork. It better fucking be the last job. That's put me in a shit mood. <laughs> I honestly can't explain why, but I'm... I'm mad. Okay. Uh. I guess just the run back and forth is so fucking annoying. Oh shit, I didn't even want to fight that. Let's stay focused. Come and yeah. get it! <sighs> Oops. Oh yeah, I was gonna change Gloria's job. Um, I've also got some uh, experience items that I can give her. Actually, let's do that. Let's do that. Jobs. Let's change Gloria's job to Bard, um, and then let's put White Mage as sub job. Oh, we got a rise. That's cool. Um, okay. We don't have any... This way. This is fucking unbelievable. 
I hate this guy. I hope he fucking dies of starvation out here. Fuck you. Now go back. Again. No, no way. Alright. I don't even remember what we get out of this. It's probably not even worth it. Entrance. Ugh. Thank fuck it's over. Ugh. That's such a relief. Alright. Why doesn't he appreciate what I did? Okay, that's, that's actually kind of worth it. Alright. It's annoying as fuck. But a large JP orb is actually kind of good. Um, in fact, it's so good that let's use it now. Um, items. Wait, where's the... Okay, here we go. Let's level up the bard. Holy fuck, level five. Nice. Oh, it increased by 30. Okay, well, that's kind of not worth it anymore. Eh, it's kind of worth it. Um, now, we need Adele's speed to increase. She's a mug, she's got to be fast, and she's got to be dodgy. Alright. Cool! Let's go talk to this guy, and then we'll be done with this episode. Hey, All right. I was wondering if I could ask you about Bernard. Bernard? Hmm. Judging by the look on your face, this is serious. Come with me. Okay, here we go. It should be safe to talk here. What did you want to know? Well, one of my family's heirlooms, a great treasure, has been stolen, and Ooh, we I may like that have bard. heard a rumor the that it was Bernard fire. who was responsible. Is that so? Well, it suddenly sounds possible. You see, he may be the proprietor of the gaming hall these days, but that is not how his career began. He was once a renowned thief. <gasps> quite an dun, dun, dun. Some say he even stole the building which now houses the gaming hall. It used to be the mansion of an elder by the name of Lupus. Interesting. And if the same rumors are to be believed, he keeps all his ill That's gotten a thief. games Always in a that thief. building over there. That scum! He can be seen going in and out at all hours of the day and night. Has anybody tried to get inside? Well, yes, but they died soon after. A very unfortunate accident. Or Quite a warning quite accident. to anyone else <laughs> foolish enough to try the same thing. I like Bernard less and less the more I hear about him. He is dangerous. Please, be careful. Oh, there you are. Oh, we got Prince a bit of Custer. freezing there. I have explained that's my okay. position to Dronid. Bernard's behavior is a black mark on our nation's name. His wicked deeds must be exposed. I hope you will forgive me for oh, using God. your presence as an opportunity Dromed's to cleanse be... my kingdom of wrongdoers, your highness. In return, I will, of Bernard. course, assist you in any way that I can. To that end, I hope that my joining you will smooth your passage through Savalon. Do you have any objections to my accompanying you? 
Of course not, Your Highness. How could we refuse the offer of a prince's aid? You honor us. The honor is all mine. Now tell me, did you learn any more of the situation? We sure did. So listen to this. Intriguing. Oh God. It seems further investigation is in order. Shall we? So, but what if Prince Castor is in Bernard's pocket too? I guess we'll find out in the next cliffhanger episode. Goodbye.